Hey Brick Maniacs, welcome back to another Friday sit rep. We do have a new Humvee up on the docket for this weekend. You can use that promo code drop day, save yourself 15% today only when you get in on that pre-order. Plus we got some other cool stuff to take a look at. Uh, and to make things even sweeter, we got 20% off all books uh, and magazines in stores and online as well. So make sure to stop by, take advantage there because the stores do carry more books than we do online. Uh, so you'll be able to see what's eligible from them. Otherwise, we got a lot to get to today. So let's dive on in. All right, so we're kicking things off, taking a closer look at the brand new uh, Humvee with gunner protection unit. Uh, here's our little digital spinny render friend. And then we've also got a, uh, a pretty much completed prototype <laughs> sitting here. I mean, obviously we still got our test ninja in here, but this kit actually doesn't include any minifigures because we already sell the accompaniments. Um, and so you've got pretty much what would be a completed model here. Right, right. So this is, this is uh a modern Humvee. This is a M1151 A1, which is a up armored <laughs> Nailed fa it. factory factory made up armored Humvee, and the GPK, the Gunner Protection Kit, up on the roof here. So this would be very similar. This is this is actually, it, it, although it looks like it would be like perfect, like for the 1990s your Mogadishu. It's not. This is actually a much more right. modern Humvee. Um, this is the you know the heavier duty uh, he heavier duty chassis, um, built in armor. Um, and this one actually has the amphibious kit too, so it mm -hmm. has the, the snorkel and the and the exhaust. So this would be you know just at home in, in the Marine Corps, it would be in the Army. But uh, you know if you're doing amphibious amphibious landings, you're bringing this in on your LCAC that you're gonna there drop you go. drop the drop the ramp down. And a lot of storm. them in on the LCACs, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah a dozen a dozen yeah, of them. Dozen. In the Holy smokes! <laughs> uh, but this is this is very modern. This would be you know you'd find this all over all over Europe and the NATO countries and everywhere else in the world, mm -hmm. in fact. But uh, this is this 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 particular uh, gunner protection kit is very common um, mm -hmm. and in fact I the reason I was inspired to do this is I was seeing that these things were actually being used sent over to um, uh, in the Ukraine right now oh yeah uh, you know the, a lot of NATO countries have them and they're like the, the you know there's a need for mm -hmm. uh, transportation over there for, for troops on the ground well and obviously um, Humvee is pretty tried and true when it comes to being a, 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 a military vehicle right right it's not you know it's it's not like the same as a, it's it's not technically not an armored vehicle it's, it's right. still considered a soft skin vehicle and they've just up armored it a little bit to give some some ballistic protection against uh, you know shell hit small small uh, shell fragments and of course uh, you know small arms fire um, of course, we have the, this one has a 50 caliber on the top. You can change this 50 caliber for M2 M240. Um, I just been seeing a lot of 50 calibers on them, so like we're gonna we're gonna go for it. And What's then the, the front that? of the turret is actually specifically designed that, that that'll fit that 50 caliber with the ammo box right on the side. So, mm -hmm. um, this is very typical. Keep um, the ninja safe. <laughs> it, it's it's almost identical to the the USMC uh, Humvee that we previously sold. Mm -hmm. uh, the only difference is that has a specific USMC specific. Uh, turret that with folds, the glass yeah, and it, everything it, on it, it yeah. folds it folds flat i will be actually making one of those uh in the very near future so very cool. if you're if you're missing that they'll be up, upgraded to our standards um it's it's in the wings already built but i i i, I you know we can't only make one at a time so you're going to get the uh the nato camouflage version first and then we'll have a, a marine corps tan tan version uh, to replace the, the one that we we discontinued awesome so you do get of course the, the turret rotates mm -hmm. uh all the way around the door all these these armored doors do yeah open. we recognize that door design that broke the internet the first time it got showcased <laughs> so yeah. new, new doors the the, the the with the armored windows on them um we actually this particular lego piece this this exhaust piece um it only comes in in light gray but you, you never see like a shiny new muffler on a, on a, sure. on a military vehicle so we uh we, we weathered this with our uv printing so it does have some new uv printing there's also new uv printing on the, the grill on itself. the grill um, replaces the brick built clunky brick built uh, grill mm -hmm. so this looks a little bit more like what your your humvee would really look like mm -hmm. in, in the real world um and of course we've done some new new printing we have the printing on the hood and the printing on the windscreen yep. that that is the first time we've done it in these colors so um it is a lot of new features on here but you also have a lot of the old you still have you know the opening yep the, the tailgate you, you you have the spare tire here that that would, folds out with everything yeah yep. And then you know, of course, your, your tailgate drops. Mm -hmm. So you can fit four figures inside, plus the one on the on in the gunner, you know, the turret. You would normally you wouldn't normally see them carrying five five guys, guys yeah, in, right, in a Humvee. That's 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 not they, they can they can do it for mm -hmm. sure. You could even fit a guy in the back if you really want. If there's to. if there's necessity, I mean, I'm sure that's yeah. what they do, right? Yep, yep. So it, it's you know, one breaks down, you got to grab the, the guys from the other one. That, that's, that's Don't how, leave that's them behind. Yep. Yeah. 
So it is sturdy. You know, this is this is a very sturdy design. You're not going to push the guy through the floor when you're when you're six. The sandbox inside. kid. Yeah, we yeah. love it. Love <laughs> so to hear it. It, it. it rolls real real quite well. Um, yeah, just, I don't know much more it's to, to say about it. It's it's just a Humvee, but it's also like you know everything you'd expect. Yeah, it's so. got all the bells and whistles and uh, everything you're looking for, and nothing you're not, which is awesome. And then cool to see it just returning. Like you said, it's it's the updated version of the Humvee, but it is in that uh, that really kind of iconic classic uh, camo scheme. Right, and if you're looking for an older Humvee, don't don't don't, don't have to wait too long because we are we do have more in the pipeline. We're replacing a lot of our older our older Humvees. Mm -hmm, the new um, lineup. Yeah, there'll be a complete, oh, complete new Humvee lineup for the for the course of this year. This this being the you know the early uh, the teaser for mm -hmm. what's, what's what's to come. Always exciting to end a, an episode segment on staying tuned for what's to come and looking forward to a, a rest of a brand new lineup, especially when it's something as iconic as the Humvee. This is definitely an awesome one to kick it off with. And remember, for today only, you can use that promo code Drop Day, save yourself fifteen percent. Dan, thanks for checking in. All right, and a couple of quick segments here before we wrap things up. It's a little early for the uh, 245th branch birthday, uh, but we're kind of rolling through all of the branches here. Started with the Navy, and now we have the Marines tile pack. Uh, so this is what the entire 25-piece tile pack would look like, but you can also purchase them individually, either enlisted or officers. And then once again, I just set up a little stand here with uh, one of our Marine minifigures uh, to showcase some of the display options, a possible gift idea, depending on your reason for picking these up. But like I said, we've got them available in the packs and individually as well. So you can make your selection, make your selections, pick up just the ones you want or grab the entire thing. Uh, we only made 15 packs, but if there's interest in more of them, we can put more together based off of the individuals. So we'll see how they sell. And because everybody needs some fire support, we got some uh, uh, archers now to go along with the Legionnaires from last week. So these are the Roman Auxiliary Archers sticker pack that we have here as, uh, as well as the uh, custom created helmet. As you can see, then we got it set up with some Lego accessories and obviously you need the Lego minifigure itself, uh, but you can check those out if you're working on building your, your Roman Legion army or if you picked up the fort and need to add some more, some more archers, etc. You'll be able to customize obviously all the faces, etc. Using those uniforms, pick up however many helmets you need and there you have it. All right, so that'll about do it for me here on a Friday. Remember that 20% off instruction books and magazines does run through Thursday, so take advantage of that all week long. Uh, and then we've got some good stuff coming back on Monday, so make sure to tune in. I think the ACAB crew pack, uh, as well as a couple of other cool things, so we'll make sure to dive in and take a little closer look then. Otherwise, have a wonderful weekend, and thank you very much for watching.